Hey everyone, it's OBC TV. It's Kevin and Rick, who is the owner and the head brewer at the Outlaw Brewing Company. Hey, Rick. How are you today? I'm doing great. You know why? Because I have a pint in front of me. Cheers. Cheers. All right, so what are we drinking today? We call Rick? this work, yeah. I know. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we drinking today? This is Lunar Landing. Oh, we've been talking about Lunar yeah, Landing. Yeah, this thing has been um, just rocking, rocking for us. Mm. And I remember you called this a, a New Hampshire IPA. Is that it? Yeah. All right, so because I like New Hampshire, I know you like. I'm New in New Hampshire. Hampshire. We're big on New Hampshire. We like New Hampshire. We have a lot of uh, things to talk about today that are based here in New Hampshire. But uh, why do you call it a New Hampshire IPA? Because I want to. Okay. Any other reason why? No. Because we hear uh, New England IPA, IPA thrown around all different, uh, all different ways. So, Lunar Landing, New Hampshire IPA. New Hampshire IPA. <laughs> Now you can check it out right Come here. Come So it is a bit hazy. Um, it's got a lot of uh, oats and barley, and um, we use a new hop, uh, Comet hops that we haven't used in the past. Oh. And uh, that hop's been around since the '90s, and it was way too too uh, too soon for its time. And it, it it's got some grassy notes to it that uh, are really popular right now. Um, so we brought something back, and we, we figured we'd uh, launch this one to the moon. See, that's the description I was looking for right there. <laughs> this is a really good summer beer. It's, I think this is a really good all-year beer. Um, all-year beer. Yeah. Think of it. When there's snow on the ground, we're drinking Lunar Landing. Lunar Landing is off tap right here at the Outlaw Brewing Company. Only place. Outlaw Brewing Company, by the way, hits the road this Saturday. Big event. Remember months ago, we put on those silly hats and we were hanging out at the Wyman Tavern? Where's my hat? I don't know. You said you were going to get hats this week. <sighs> I failed. All right, Wyman Tavern and the Wyman Tavern Brew Festival is coming up this Saturday uh, from 1 until 5. I think there's a VIP entrance uh, at noon and we've been uh, attending this, this beer festival. Nice little beer festival right on Main Street in Keene. Yeah, it's a great beer festival. There's, um, I think, between four and 450 tickets sold. Uh, every year it gets more popular. Um, they always have some great food. Mm. Uh, this year they've got some food demos. So I know that I'm paired up with Luca. We're gonna do some- Luca! Yeah, uh, we're gonna do some food <laughs> demos. He's gonna pair our beer and, and cook with our beer. So um, nice. it's gonna be a, a, a super great event. And uh, I'm really fortunate to have you taking care of the tap room while I'm up, up there. Uh, slinging some beer. That's right. If you go to the Wyoming Tavern Brew Fest or if you come to the Outlaw Brewing Company on Saturday, it's a win-win situation, folks. And I'm not talking about the Chinese place on Main Street here in Greenfield uh, or, or in Winchester. That was a, a uh, shameless plug. It was a shameless plug. <laughs> so, um, music Saturday. Oh, yeah. Music Saturday. Mm -hmm. While I'm here at the uh, Outlaw Brewing Company, who is on the schedule for this Sebastian Saturday? Sebastian is back. Nice. Yeah. Oh, great kid. Great yeah. voice. Plays the guitar right here outside. I looked at the long range forecast for Saturday and it looks really good. It looks really good if you're going to the Wyman Tavern Brewfest. It looks really good if you're stopping by the Outlaw Brewing Company here on Scotland Road yeah, in Winchester. And many of the beers that we have here on tap we'll be bringing up to the Wyman Tavern Brewfest. We'll probably bring a few. Um, they're kind of coming back. I'm going to bring uh, Prodigal, which is our black IPA. Oh, neat. That's our collaboration with Ashwell Brewing Company. Cool. Um, we'll bring Emma. I'm gonna bring Emma up there, mm -hmm. and uh, I think it's it's important for us to bring peanut butter white stout. Oh. Um, if you have not come here to have our peanut butter white stout, that's gonna um, knock them yeah, out of the park. It is absolutely. So. All right, lots of information online if you're interested in stopping by the Outlaw Brewing Company. Of course, Facebook and Instagram and the Outlaw Brewing Company .com. By the way, I found out a lot of information about the Wyman Tavern Brewfest via Facebook if you just search Wyman Tavern Brewfest. So you can go there for more information as well. Tap Room Hours right here at the Outlaw Brewing Company on Scotland Road, Winchester, New Hampshire. We'd love to see you Friday evenings between 6 and 9. 6 and 9. And then on Saturdays from 1 until 9. I'll be here this Saturday till open. Right. So you're uh, not here till 2. Oh, Saturday. that's right. We're opening a little bit late because of... Uh... Oh, no, no, no. This Saturday I'm fine. Oh, okay. Yeah, this Saturday I'm fine. Uh, it's it, not I'm... what you told me. Is that what I said? Yeah. Right, we're going to have to go over our schedules. <laughs> until 9 o'clock on Saturday, and then on Sunday, it's 1 until 7. 1 to 7, yeah. And and both Saturday and Sunday, actually this past weekend, we were busy every single uh, day. It was awesome. Excellent. New people, repeats, it was all good. All right. Right here. Oh, that is right. I, I remember Saturday now. I'm, I'm not going to be here till 2 o'clock. See? <laughs> 
There's a lot going on. <laughs> Get caught up online at theoutlawbrewingcompany.com. And until next time, uh, this is OBC TV. Cheers. Cheers. Boy, that thing is good. <laughs>